Okay, welcome in another video. In this video, I'm going to talk about Discord. In the previous video, I talked about Discord, how you can earn money with uh, Discord. And here, I'm going to show you the business model behind it so you can get a general idea how it can work for you and what you need to do in order to realize it. Keep in mind, a business model is something that you can use. And when you use it well, it can help you a lot. So if you do it well, you can also see, okay, this business model works for me or it doesn't work for me. That's technically it. So when you have a Discord, technically you have you have a community. They are on a Discord. Some people can become member. And some people they are just Discord. But they are not a member, they are not a pay member. That's technically it. So they are on your community. And on the community you can offer different kind of things to the members. If they're high tier member, low tier, it's up to you. So the people that become member, they are your customer segments. And you have tier one, tier two, tier three, and then tier, yeah, and the rest. Let's call it. Doesn't matter how you call it. It's just so you can see this. Yeah, if you offer them value, you ask them what's the value. Then? They become part of your community. Your community so is already something unique because they are there for you. Keep that in mind. And you're offering entertainment, music and other stuff it depends what you're offering yeah how do you communicate with them on discord when you communicate with them the channel you use discord to communicate direct with them or they can communicate direct with you or the moderator will help you manage the discord so that's technically how it works the channel is technically the discord itself yeah so if you look at this the resource that you need you have to have a discord server the activity you post some things on the discord this is really this is really up to you yeah what you do the cost here you can buy nitro on discord is not that high but you can pay for it it can make the experience on discord much better but the cost is not that high the problem is if you have a manager or let's say a moderator you have to pay them in order to help you manage your discord some people do it for free some not it depends what kind of relationship you have with them but if i were you i would pay them because when you pay them they do much better the job so moderator they can help you manage the discord and the revenue that you can get is the people when they become member they will buy the things on the discord it, most of the time those are digital products and the revenue on digital pro project most of the time is 95 percent you just need to pay the service cost and all the stuff so technically digital products it can be your music or other stuff and then you can sell it for high tiers or they get this certain kind of service doesn't matter but this is the revenue stream so this is technically if you look at the discord you have this as the business model yeah and it doesn't change a lot but the membership you can offer them to your customers but the problem is starting with it and growing so if you start today and you build it up it can build momentum but if you start like a week later, because just you need to understand this, it's not going to help you. Uh, you just need to wait much more longer. So keep in mind, just start today, even small yourself with one member, build it up. People will become subscriber members, and then that's it. You will build a community in that um, on your Discord. And even if you have 10 people, 100 people, that's a good thing. Because momentum, if you get 10,000, Discord will help you promote your service. That's technically how you need to see it. So if you have a question about it, what you can do is ask me. You can just go on a Discord or Discord. You can create a support ticket. It's for free. You can ask me a question and I will see if I can help you or not. It's not like I'm going to give you a complete legal advice and for free or whatever. Keep in mind, you can just ask me a question. If I can answer for you, I can answer. If I cannot answer, I will tell you. That's technically it. So if you're new to this channel, subscribe. Subscribe right now. You see the subscribe button? Press it. You did it? Good job. Really. Good job. Okay. I hope you guys like this video and I will see you guys in the next one.